Resubitism or people convicted of reoffending crimes is an issue many county jails see, but a group here in the East is trying to provide resources to inmates to stop that from happening. That in your sides, Ariana Kraft gives us an inside look at how one program operates inside a county detention center. In this jail you see behind me, inmates are learning life skills and healing through music thanks to a program from Cry Freedom Missions. Today, I found out why these efforts are so valuable. Every Thursday, inmates at Wayne County Jail sing together, learn together, and reflect on their lives. For um, a lot of things that I've had gone through in life and stuff, it's brought me back to life. Music is a universal language. It instills hope. I love the music. <laughs> I'm a big music fan. But that's not all this program offers. They teach us other things like, you know, life skills. We do things about like budgeting and math and stuff like that, even parenting classes. It teach me the values of what I have to offer. Beverly Weeks works in different jails across the state. She sees the value in each and every person at the detention center. I'm beautiful, I'm beautiful, I'm beautiful. She recognizes how limited mental health resources has hurt many of these women. A lot of these women don't even need to be in jail. They don't need to be in jail. They need mental health services. One inmate tells me she's learned that freedom begins in your own mind and she's looking forward to her future. There's things that they teach that you know you put in place while you're here and then you go outside and you use more of that. Sheriff Larry Pierce encourages other county jails to provide these kinds of resources to inmates. There's no reason why you can't offer them something while they are being in a detention facility to give them some hope. I just love that I came to this place not knowing um, that I would have a second chance at life. Working as a nonprofit, Cry Freedom Missions relies heavily on donations to continue programs like this one. We have more information on how you can help out at WNCT.com. In Goldsboro, Ariana Kraft, 9 on your side.